Now to a Fox follow-up story we first told you about earlier this month. It's been three weeks since burglars broke into a family's home on the northwest side and stole their beloved parrot that spoke hundreds of words. Now comes news another family not far away just had both of their expensive parrots stolen too. Fox San Antonio's Robert Price joins us now to explain why investigators think both cases may be connected. Well, good evening. Here's a look at one of the flyers and both break-ins at homes just miles apart on the northwest side. The crooks passed up all sorts of valuables and went straight for the parrots. Highly intelligent African gray parrots. That's my baby. <laughs> That's Greta. Cindy Sheely isn't giving up the search for her pet parrot, Greta. I will continue to look for her until I'm no longer around. It's been three weeks now since burglars kicked in Sheely's front door and snatched the 13-year-old Congo African Grey from her cage. Somebody out there has to know something. It's like having a family member abducted. Mary Brenner knows the feeling. Thursday morning, crooks kicked in her front door and stole 13-year-old Bob and 8-year-old Molly. Both the cage doors were open. They were gone. Much like Sheely's parrot Greta, Bob is a Congo African Grey with a vocabulary of hundreds of words. He inserts little phrases like you'll say things and he'll say, is that right? Hello, Molly. <laughs> Chirpy. Molly is a Temni African Grey, smaller, more laid back. They're priceless. They cannot be replaced. Soon, Cindy Sheely heard the news. Another parrot owner had been hit. Shocked. I couldn't believe somebody would do this again. She reached out to Mary and says the similarities between the break-ins can't be a coincidence. They took a bit of this, a bit of that, and left a lot of other stuff they could have taken, just like they did to me. But I kind of thought, are they going around stealing parrots now? What's up with this? This now to me says there's something going on. So she ran her theory past the detective working her case. He said, you know, this is strange enough for us to think, yeah, there's somebody out there who wants these birds. Yes, they're worth money, but money is not what I'm looking at here. I want my birds back. If you own birds out there, people, keep them protected, keep them safe. Mary Brenner says Bob is microchipped and Molly is banded. Crime Stoppers is offering a reward for information leading to an arrest in Cindy Sheely's case. If you know anything about either crime, call 224-STOP. In the newsroom, Robert Price, Fox News at 9.